So, I, I am a little bit late to the party. Sorry for that. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I have heard of the news that Activision is going to take one year off for Call of Duty 2023. And for my for my surprise, that is great. This is exactly what this franchise needed. Not really so a year break, more like a permanent break until they're back to making another killer Call of Duty. But hey, a year is a year. We got something. Something is better than nothing. So Treyarch is going to be, you know, um, producing the next Call of Duty. This year we are getting Modern Warfare 2, numeral 2, and a new Warzone experience. Can't wait for all that good stuff. So, you know, Call of Duty has not been doing good recently. So hopefully that extra year of development, so four years that Treyarch you know has with Call of Duty Black Ops whatever hopefully it can come out to being a really good um, Call of Duty and they can also set the standard of giving time more time to games that needs to be polished and everything so it could be like a really great experience and hopefully you know they can continue Activision can keep continuing doing that with every single Call of Duty not really so giving it a year but maybe giving it maybe two three years or maybe give it like five years to flesh out its life cycle and everything with content and all that good stuff and then to move on with another good Call of Duty because I know they can do that and a three-year development is not like enough that I see from you know how modern warfare modern warfare 2019 or um black ops 4 or cold war or vanguard so you know that's good i'm really excited but everybody's saying like oh my it's because of like the microsoft purchase deal or whatever you know they're just saying it because you know maybe microsoft has some influence on it and if they did that's great because maybe they can stretch it out to maybe giving a, a call of duty more life life to fill out more of its life cycle and not really just for one year to make another one you know if this was microsoft doing i thank them so much for buying that division and saving call of duty because man it just it's in like in a rough state and with this fan base and everything so i think giving it a year is good we just gotta wait and see am i getting modern warfare 2 this year that is a good probability i will buy it but depends on how i feel when i try the beta and everything if the beta is good i'm gonna buy it if not then i'll will i will i will wait until black until Treyarch's next call of duty to buy call of duty again like i would guarantee it because i didn't buy vanguard vanguard was cool and all but it's just like it's it's, it's ridiculous man so yeah can't wait to see all that good stuff let me know what you guys think down below in the comment sections about you know all this about call of duty taking a year off and all that good stuff because that actually puts a smile on my face and hopefully for 2024's call of duty would be a much more neat and polished state of what call of duty has been needing for such a long time and hopefully it could set you know a new standard of you know delaying and gaming giving it more time so all that good stuff so anyways guys take care have a wonderful morning night day evening whatever vacations please take care once more and stay safe and yeah guys later